parents finalize their families back to school plans, child care shortage is only compounding the stress for many East Texas parents. That's right, and Fox 51's Rachel Davis spoke with professionals today, and she tells us what parents need to know when choosing child care. There's a lot of wait lists on, I'm, I feel like, pretty much every day here. A report from Child Care Aware of America reveals 16,000 child care providers shut down during the pandemic. And U.S. labor numbers show more than 1,000 workers left the industry, making it difficult for parents to find child care. I don't know of any center around here that does not have a waiting list. Kim Walker owns Mimi's Creative Kids Learning Center in Athens. She says parents should think ahead and start their search early. Henderson County is what they call like a desert area. We do not have enough daycare centers or learning centers for the amount of kids that we need in care. Walker recommends visiting more than one place and reading each child care handbook. Um, and you need to read that because that has every kind of um, requirement that that facility has. She also urges parents to visit the facilities themselves before finalizing a decision. Um, I would go in a class. I would want to see the classrooms and see how they're operated, see how they're set up. Do they seem like they're safe? Do they seem like it's an, a happy atmosphere that the kids would have fun in? Parents should know what their family's needs are and look for those specifics. Every daycare has good and bad. It just depends on what fits your life and what you're needing at that moment. What might fit you today may not fit you tomorrow or next year. Following these steps can help parents find a facility they can trust for their children. Child care is expensive, but you can't put a price on good child care. You can't do it. You want your kids to be safe. Rachel Davis, Fox 51 News.